Good afternoon, Key Forgers, She Forgers, They Forgers, every kind of forger. Welcome to the Key Forge Coffee Break for Friday, January 15th, 2021. Cameron Weaver here with you. Play some more Key Forge. And uh, gosh dang it, if we aren't excited about some Key Forge. And the fact that it's Friday, we made it through another just bad week. <laughs> So hopefully y'all had a better week and uh, we can enjoy the weekend now. Guys, this week I have been, uh, <clears throat> guys and girls, guys, girls and non-binaries. It's just a habit to say guys, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> we got ska music going on. Oh boy, it's a weird Friday. Um, but we are, we, I've been revisiting some Mass Mutation decks this week that uh, don't get a lot of love. Uh, because I found some really, really good Mass Mutation decks from this set. Um, but today, this is definitely not one of those. This is a bad deck. <laughs> so let's take a look at it. We're just going to be silly on today's Keyforge Coffee Break. <laughs> this is Sir Caprazzle Foreman. And yes, that is a 57 sass. Mass Mutation deck. Did you know they made them that low? 54 base arc, 5 synergy, minus 1 anti-synergy, minus 1 meta, whatever that means. And I am a firm believer that Sass is just a number. But this deck is weird and has a lot of stuff going against it. So, bad deck? Sure. Weird deck? Yes. Expected Embers 21, that's pretty cool, right? If it works. 21 creatures, 2 upgrades, 13 actions. There's some fun stuff. Is this deck going to lose every match? No, of course not. Because that's not how Keyforge is. But, here's what I mean. We have a troop call with one Niffilate. Classic. We've got to look what I found. Return one of each card type. Action, artifact, creature, and upgrade. I don't have any artifacts. <laughs> and that's an Omega. <laughs> so let me clog up my hand and then end my turn. We've got four subdues, none of which are enhanced. So it's just the classic subdue, you know? Um, but other than that, it's, it's, yeah, it's not a great deck, but it's going to be fun. What's up, Orion? Welcome back. So good to have you this week. And hello, babe. Thanks for the lurk. Love you so much. But yeah, this is our uh, this is our funny deck of the day. <clears throat> we're gonna see. <laughs> we're gonna see if we can squeak out any kind of win with Sir Caprazzle Foreman. Uh, but we're definitely gonna be playing this on the casual side of the Crucible. <laughs> Glad I've been able to catch a few more. Keep up the good work. Thanks, though, Ryan. I appreciate it. I really, really do. And just let me know if you ever want to play a game. All right. So let's give them a good luck. Have fun. And let's see if we can win. Let's see if we can figure out what Sir Caprazzle Foreman wants to do. Four subdues in this boy. <laughs> Not to mention a wild bounty that is enhanced itself where the rest of the Untamed House is not that enhanced. Not a great opening hand. I hate playing Bo Nithing for nothing, but honestly, the Fidget and the Subtle Auto is kind of fun. We'll, we'll keep it, we'll keep it. Skaw, dude! What's up, T-Mama? Glad T-Mama's been around, too. Yeah, how good is this? Pretzel Rock's got a Ska channel. So Fidget actually coming down and killing that Gub. Subtle Auto taking a card out of their hand. Oh, Brobnar Ambassador. That's pretty cool. Whoa! I don't even know what that language is. This is cool as hell. Is this where I come to get my keys forged? I'm locked out of my house and I'm frustrated. Everyone's rolling into the coffee break today. What's up, Jordy? Dude, this is, uh... We would like to see some keys being forged here, you know? Look at... Hey, maybe I was wrong about this deck. <laughs> Let's play Sigil of Brotherhood. We can't play it, so we will just discard it. <laughs> Jordan, you gonna jump into the ring with me today? 
Uh oh. Calfine clearing the board, and that's it. Interesting. Interesting. What does Stampede do? If you use three or more creatures this turn, steal two. Do I even have three or more creatures in Untamed? Oh, I have six. Okay, that could that could work later. The Star Alliance for now. Throw down Scout Peter. Do we leave Macus Asp on top, knowing that we probably won't go back into Untamed? Uh, now I'm going to discard it. Let's subdue Calfine. Calfine's on a warpath. Then we'll throw down Yorg. <laughs> well, Jordan, today I'm using a stinker. So now, today is the day for you to test out some decks. Because I'm playing a stinker. Or what looks like a stinker. You never know. Hi, Violet. Hello, hello. Happy Friday. We got our first key of the day already. Faster than yesterday. You love to see it. Alright, so here comes some Sanctum nonsense. Let's, let's just starve them of Ember. Let's go through our deck a little bit more. We'll discard Imperial Trader. Even though it's really good against the Sanctum deck, I just don't think I'm going to call Shadows for a little bit. Let's stun... Wow, a bond is strong. Okay, let's stun a bond. Can't complain, Violet. Doing pretty good. Glad to, glad to finally be here on a Friday. Got the drunk stream to look forward to tonight. Um... Got a fun weekend planned and lined up, so I'm excited. Oh, also, for any fans of like tabletop and, and board games and fantasy adventures and stuff like that, I just downloaded Gloomhaven, the digital edition. I've never played physically, um, but I've heard only good things about it. So I got the digital adaptation, and uh, I'm gonna be starting that sometime on the channel soon. Got some really cool overlays for it, so if you're into that kind of dungeon crawling turn-based adventure system we'll have some gloomhaven content coming your way in regards to you playing a stinker uh, so you're saying there's a chance <laughs> oh look behind the scenes a little bit here's the keyforge coffee break channel or the lavinous twitch channel that will eventually uh house some other pre-recorded content. Go to youtube.com. Look for Lavender Switch. Alright, so they are just really focusing on killing my board. And not a lot else. So, we're just going to put down a couple more creatures. We're going to use Stampede. Nothing to capture. Alright, and so we are going to play Look What I Found. We're going to grab Imperial Trader. We're gonna grab Macus Asp, and that's all we can grab. But damn, see, I figured maybe we we draw some more shadow stuff. Oh, now there's a shameless YouTube channel plug. <laughs> hey man, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Self promote and all that stuff. All right, now they're starting to reap a little bit. There we go. There we go. All right, so let's let's actually go into shadows now that we have the Imperial Trader. Let's look at their hand. So Ogopogo, or Tony's Binding, Life Ward, or Tommy the Chain of Rip. So they're definitely going to go this here soon. So let's purge that Abad the Grim, which is a good purge anyway. And we've got some information. Throw down the Asp in the Nexus. So if he dare plays Life Ward and doesn't kill my Nexus, I'm popping that shit. <laughs> no, I know. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Y'all. <laughs> we got Scar. Scar, dude. Alright, let's throw down Francis. Let's throw down Bo Nithin. Let's reap with Nexus to pop that. And then who am I killing? I think I kill Ortanu. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. 
popping that shit. <laughs> yeah, I did say that. I'm just imagining a montage of childhood, you robbing local stores in Indiana of sweets while the ska music pops in the background. <laughs> it's amazing. I've just got arms full of M&Ms. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Depression and all. Me too, Jordy. It's been a week. Woo! Pick it up. Good thing my expected ember is high because my creature presence and board control is lacking, brother. This oh my gosh, this station fucks. Why do I want to see that montage more than anything? I, I do too! <laughs> That's hilarious! Can you roll over your deck list, babe? Absolutely. Well, let me do this turn real quick. Here, I'll do you one better, babe. There it is. How have I not turned on the Ska channel for these streams? Oh. Love Fridays. <laughs> Four subdues. Yeah, it's insane, actually. Oh, holy shit! What did we come back to? <laughs> oh, but I got the game anyway. Woo! That was scary. <laughs> oh my gosh! Came back to Pound Town. That's right. Holy hell! Good thing I had that ember. I did not want to deal with that Brobnar board after spending that red alert so quickly. Wow. The power of Ska and friendship got us that win today. That's Sir Caprazzle Foreman 1-0 in, <laughs> in the casual lobby on the on the Crucible today. Guys, you're watching the Keyforge Coffee Break. Happy Friday. We got Ska. We got tons of people in the chat. It's a good day. Well, Jordy, if you are, uh, if you're looking to play some Keyforge, you can meet me at table one, my dude, in the Lavinous Fam Discord. If anybody wants to join that Discord, let me hit that link in the chat right there. There's definitely a chance that Crash could finally be beaten tonight. I might wait to fuck him up until after Cortex Castle's complete. <laughs> Hey, that's, uh, I have to beat Cortex Castle first. That's not guaranteed tonight. I struggled with that for literally two hours last week. Wild. Oh, there he is. What's up, Jordy? <laughs> Hello. I'm setting up a game in the beginner lobby. All right. And the uh, password is Jordan Smells. <laughs> yes, it would. It would. <laughs> is it uh, uh, no spaces or? No spaces. All one word. All one fact. Uh, no, no caps? No cap. Simply Jordan Smells. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong, but. <laughs> uh, Part of, part of me and really, really wants to play play with a deck that I know. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna do this. Let's do it. Yeah. Chancellor Y Bricklobe. Cool, cool. Ooh, okay. There's some fun Mars stuff here. Really fun Mars stuff, actually. Three Hollow Blasters it's is a bummer. 
Okay, this is the, uh, the, the, the this is one deck that I came very close to beating you with. Nice. Okay, cool. But uh, unfortunately, could not pull off the win. Ooh, so two gateways and an arise with all of those disc creatures. That's really fun. We like to see that. Okay. Okay. Cool. My guy. Well, good luck to you, sir. There's a train going by. You too, my dude. At least love some Dis Mars nonsense. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like that, T Mama? <laughs> Maybe see if I actually want to keep his hand or not. Um, uh, oh, we are vibing today on the Keyforge Coffee Break. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, actually, we will. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, we'll keep his hand. We'll, go, we'll call Sanctum. We'll play. Uh, play Sequias first. And I forget that you can only play one card at the beginning, so. There you go. Alright, we're gonna play Wild Bounty. Which gets me an extra ember from Troop Call. But that's literally it. Don't like that. All right. Uh, Scott was like no, the it's... thing in Northern England in the 80s, early 90s. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. I love Scott. <laughs> for real, if I anyone is looking for New Wave Scott, check out the band Millington. Holy shit. Millington? Yes. Millington. It is, uh, it's like if neck deep fucked real big fish. Okay, hey, I'm into that. Sure. It's so cool, dude. I'm into that. Well, Mars. <laughs> we'll play down Crystal Hive. Mine Warper. And we'll cool. also bring out the big boy. There it is. Gosh, I hate Ether Spider. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say, I do remember uh, the last time we played with this deck. I'm pretty sure Eat the Spider had collected uh, 13 Ember from you the last time we played. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> sure if I have... I don't have great board clearing or anything, so that Ether Spider might stick around longer than I want it to. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I might just have just to start saying. running some people into it. <laughs> no, dude. Don't do that. Um, let's see here. Genuinely thought that Instagram story was going to lead into a story about one of his shits today. <laughs> <laughs> That's the gold. Stop, stop. You're okay. Um, okay. We will go Sanctum. And we'll play... Get Bulwark out there. Oh, wait, why did I... Play them over there. Damn it. Oh well. I messed up. Should have put them, uh, put them on the, to, to the right. Uh, you to can if right. you want to. We can turn on manual mode. You can drag them over. Do you mind? Yeah, no. That really it. was. Of course, dude. That really was a. Uh, this casual. A little... This casual key forge. Um. Okay. So how do I? So how do I do that now? Um. Now that it's on, just click and drag Bulwark picture over to the other side of Ether Spider and it should move him. It's not doing it. It's like saying I can put it back in my hand. But... Uh, we'll do that then. Okay. And then just play him back down. Okay. There we go. I appreciate it. Of course. Alright, how do we get... Uh, okay, you're right, Mr. Val. Okay. Yep. Um, Alright, and with that, I will... Uh, I will... Uh, re... Bulwark... And I'll end my turn. And that will work out. Set sequence. I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> so I need nine combined power. I guess I have that. It's just kind of a bummer. Okay. You know what? No, it's not a bummer. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Shadows. Oh, I didn't realize I had two bonus things in this deck. This deck is not that bad. We're gonna mug your ether spider. <laughs> no. 
I gotta fight it. And then I can add a card to my hand. I can move a card to the bottom of my deck. We'll throw down Francis. Shadow Smith will fight. And Onithin will kill the Ether Spider. Oh, you. And then we're gonna reap with Fidget, play the top card of your deck. Nope, it's Armageddon Cloak, so we just discard it. Yeah, I don't like that. I'm, ju I'm just saying I am not a fan. <laughs> <laughs> um, remi remind me, it's it's six ember to for the key, right? Yes, typically that is oh, yes. the base okay. cost. That's right. Okay. Yeah, so it uh, um, it'll show your key cost at the bottom there next to your chain. Oh, I see that now. Okay, so hmm. Does Manga actually take Let's... one off of either spider? Does it put it right back on him? Yeah, That's a great yeah. question. Let me see. So uh, Mug gains an ember due to Mug's bonus icon, which went to either spider. Mug yeah, okay, we'll, one we'll, uh, we'll do that. spider to the pool. I think it did move it to my this. pool. I think it did. Because um, when I killed either spider, it still only had two ember on it. So I think it actually yeah. does work to lift that ember off. Uh, and then... Which is interesting, actually. We'll play Arise. This spider says, each ember that would be added to your opponent's pool is captured instead. And Mug says, move one from a creature to your pool. Shoot, I'm actually going to have to rewind that and look at that. I didn't even what? think about that. What's up? Um... Oh, my okay. bad. I was, mute. I was unmuted the whole time, then I was muted... Yeah. It's, it's all right. moving, not gaining, so it works weird. Yeah, so uh, Orion in the chat was asking about that Ether Spider move. Right. Ether Spider says, when Ember would be moved to your opponent's pool, it goes to Ether Spider instead. But Mug says, move one Ember from a creature to your pool. And oh. I can't remember if that Ember actually did make it to my pool or if it went right back to Ether Spider. So I'm going to need to replay the tape later. Yeah, I actually don't remember. That's a fun interaction, though. <laughs> uh, all right, and then we're gonna play uh, play a chariot. Damn you! <laughs> and <laughs> and also play toxic. Uh, I don't like your disc sweep. I'll tell you that much right now. <laughs> and that'll end my turn. Also, really did also did you uh did did you, did you see the uh, the last card I I discarded? The rise. Yeah. Interesting. I mean, it makes sense. You don't want to change yourself yeah. if you can't use it. Like, take a, take a guess at what can uh, what house I I picked. <laughs> oh, you did use it. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm assuming I'm gonna see Ether Spider soon. I mean, I'm. I think I just need to reap out with what I've got. So we're gonna go shadows. Francis. Yeah, we'll hit Shred. Excuse me. Um, <laughs> we'll kill Shred. We'll reap with Fidget. Play Cleansing Wave. Interesting. Ah. Reap. Reap. Okay, this was a bad decision. I played against so many decision. annoying Arise decks uh... lately. I know, it's like getting Wait, a resurgence. Yeah. It's so funny. I don't feel right It's now. fun how people, like, just keep rediscovering uh... metas and bring them back out to the group. You know what? I feel like we need something. I feel like we just need a cleanse really quick. Uh-oh. I feel an Yeah, we need oh. a cleanse. Yeah, that was smart. That was good. That was good. <laughs> it, it, it just needed to happen. My board was out of control. A little bit. It's little mostly bit. annoying because I don't own one. I feel that. Uh, that's how I feel about Dark Harbinger. Yeah, that's all I can do. <laughs> so go ahead and get, and get your key. Thank you. I will. All right, we'll go Star Alliance. Oh, 
I don't know why I did that in that order. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely misplayed there. Alright, alright. Um, it's not like I won't see another subdue this game. I have four of them. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um... Sounds like a ska game show. <laughs> <laughs> I freaking love this channel. Is that video done yet? Oh, yeah, we'll do, uh, we'll do this. We'll play, uh, play Shackles. And we'll also play Key Hammer. Aw, damn it. And that's all I got. You're slowing me down. <laughs> Shaffles is not elusive. Okay. Oh yeah, and you also lost that uh the that the ember because I uh, went we went what ember because of Shaffles. Pretty nice. Ah, oh, it's gone. Go down Cephalois, get rid of Gloriana's attendant. I don't care about Gloriana's attendant. <laughs> not even worth having the body. Oh wow. Well, I just get. Okay. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> nope, I don't believe in them. Go Mars. I don't support them. Play a Minesweeper? My, my Mind Warper? Play another Mind Warper. I don't like those Mind Warpers. Bring out my Eva Spider. Welcome back, you rat <laughs> bastard. I think, uh, I think John Smythe needs to make an appearance. Oh, there's so many targets. And then, uh, Zilly Marauder, you wanna come out, buddy? Oh boy. Pretty good. That's that's a lineup right there. Do you not uh do you not do his play thing? It's for each re friendly ready Mars creature. Oh I should have waited! I mean You can take him back into your hand if you want. Uh, it's not bad. No. I mean while he's down. I you can still use him to reap as a body with Crystal Hive next turn. That's true. That's true. Yeah, I'll 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 I'll, I'll do that. I uh, I I messed up. And I got I got I gotta learn to learn to actually read stuff before I play it. Marauder's just such a weird card. You're you. Most of the time, you don't get that play effect anyway. I think he's better as a body on the field right now. Right. So. Don't beat yourself up over it. Man, this, oh, this is actually a bummer. So, there's so many guys I need to kill over there. We're gonna just start with the spider. Because I can oh. still do John Smith. For now, anyway. Hmm. All right, what did I, uh, what did I get here? Right, Team Mama? Isn't Millington mm -hmm. awesome? Peter Pan's gonna find me. Gonna just appear in my room one night. Him on the left side of my bed, the shadow on the right. <laughs> Kick my ass okay. to never yeah. land. I'll play, uh, play Mars. Oh man, this track is well, so good. Marauder is well, sad, especially on. for being one of the main Coda art pieces. I gun. agree. Hey, what's up, Bing? Hello, hello. Games. I know Marauder has such Crystal cool Hive. and iconic art, but he's just not that good. Remove the stun from John Smythe. Oh, that's dangerous. I gotta kill this board. We're gonna reap with my with my warmer. Reap my warmer again. Damn. And also reap with uh Damn, that's a key's worth of ember and three reaps. See that's that's good shit. Um gosh, I really wish that you didn't uh take out that Eater Spider. I'm just saying. <laughs> I, I, I I'm just saying. 
<laughs> um, Tom and that's all I can Crystal do. And John Smith? That's insane! The combos! Alright, I gotta... Ugh, I gotta... Alright. <sighs> wow, okay, yeah. Damn, I can only... I can only kill one! Unless I... Yeah, I... Well... <laughs> okay. Alright, we're gonna use Yorg to capture the blast shielding on Yorg. Garcia will hit Smith. Secure droid will kill it. So I keep you off the key. You still have three Mars creatures that can just reap till the till the day is over. You know that <laughs> old expression. <laughs> oh, Bing, how you doing, buddy? Happy weekend. Uh, see, yeah. hey, uh, I can't get over how good this Scott channel is. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Well, how do I, uh, how do I... Oh, wait, what? Oh, wait, why is my current key cost eight? Because of Garcia's uh, fight reap effect. Um, okay. Oh, yep, there it is. You turd. I just <laughs> read it. I don't like that. <laughs> um. Hmm. Okay. So. So, a so question. If, if yes. I, I go, if I um. If I, if I want to use a card's action, can I? Is it is, is like is that the same as? It's not the same as reaping. Like like it's just like I use the action and it's automatically like like I've used it. Right. Yes. So if okay. a creature has an action, when you use it, you have the option to use that action instead of reaper fight. Gotcha. So you won't get ember from it, but yeah. Right. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. I will uh use. Use Crystal Hive. Very nice. And we are just going to keep reaping. Because I that's, that, that's what I can do right now. Hell yeah. I think that's a good strategy. I really, really do. It would Especially be much... I'm not killing your Mars creatures as quickly as I need to. It'd be a great... It'd be an even better strategy um, if um, uh, you didn't already have two keys forged and... Uh, two embers away from getting another one. Right. Luckily, Got yeah. Me, Luckily, this deck, what it lacks in everything else, it does have ember generation. Uh, I'm not moving the blast shield. I'll keep it right where it is. Damn, I'm still not in check, but I made that key cost a lot. I'm doing well, Bing. True. Thank you for asking. True. Oh, and Went to the dentist this morning, did a workout, like kind of studying. Brain is pretty fried, so I might take um, the day off, play some games. Hell yeah, man. You gotta all right, I take care of yourself. Able to, uh, it's the freaking weekend, baby. Like, see what I got. That's cool, though, man. Uh, glad it's, I'm glad it's going so well. Good for you. January, off to a good start for you. We stand. But yeah, I'm doing well, man. I'm excited for the weekend. I've had two cups of okay. coffee already, and I'm listening to okay. Ska. Yeah. <laughs> and play yeah. Keyforge. It's a good day. I'll just sank them, actually. Bring it on. That actually scares me. <laughs> Fortunately, it works Saturday, Sunday, all day. <laughs> we'll play, uh, we'll play Tana, 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 take the hostages. Not beer by RBF, but it's good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, we did get an ember, and then uh, uh, fight for the friendly creature. Uh... Beer by it real it big fish. Well. So fucking good. <laughs> and uh, oh damn. Playing. Let's see. Yeah, we'll do that. And just to put some damage down. We'll do that. Uh, Garcia. I really want to get rid of Garcia. Oh, I should have waited and and played and played another card. 
There we go. There I go again. Not reading stuff. What is it? We can um, we can rewind it. No, no, no. You're learning. Yeah. I'll, okay. If you don't. If you, okay. If you don't mind. Yeah. What you got? Uh, I want to uh, uh, instead instead of playing uh, instead of, uh, instead of um, playing Zen, like Zen Zakiel at that at that moment. I was gonna play my uh, my and my uh, champion my champion Anafiel instead. And then fight with Anafiel. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. So turn on manual mode. Can you drag Marauder back to the field and Zekiel back into your hand? Yes. Perfect. And then Perfect. I will. Can you take all the damage off of Garcia? Yeah. There we go. There we go. Go for it. All right. I appreciate it. Of course. So we're going to play Anna, Anna Fuel there. Then play Zetna and Zekiel. And Anafield can absolutely kill Garcia and capture. Yep. Very nice. And then we're also gonna move, we're, we're, we're gonna play Hall Hallowed Blaster to heal uh, to heal Anafield. All right, this isn't uh, this is starting to scare me a little bit. And we'll play another Hallowed Blaster. And then I'll have my turn. Upsetting. 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 All right, we're gonna go sh shadows this turn. Subtle Auto is going to discard a card out of your hand. Oh, good target. Uh, yeah. Throw down my Macus Asp and Nexus, and then we'll play Imperial Trader to look into your hand. Aww. That's scary. That's really scary. <laughs> okay, back to you. <laughs> We are going to Okay, let's see here. Can you read it? Can someone please explain why Bartleby won't leave his office staring at the brick wall? Twenty seven empty red bulls on his desk, but that's not all. If he doesn't leave, we'll probably have to relocate. He just won't obey so we Uh we'll go Mars. Bartleby yeah. the Scrivener. <laughs> that sounds like a keyboard deck. <laughs> you will play. My, we'll use my, my mother gun's ability. Kill some. We'll kill some. Subtle, subtle, subtle auto. Mm -hmm. And then. We'll play. Uh, Okay. Yes. Then we'll play a uh, play Tunk. Tunk. And then uh, we will uh, we'll, we'll play a kind com pod reveal that you know, that am ammonia cloud to hit into ready Tunk. Nice. Play Crystal Hive. Neat. And we will handle we'll reap. Uh, yeah, we'll reap with Tunk, and we'll actually use use uh, my Mind Warper's ability. Have Yorga or capture one of your own Ember. Nice. And then we will reap with uh, Z with Zillion Marauder. Damn. And that's my turn, ladies and gentlemen. Spooky. Hmm. Okay. Gotta get into check. So I'm gonna steal one. We're gonna put the Observe you Max on Pete. Pete's gonna reap and discard Subdue, but he's gonna capture one. I'm gonna play Subdue number three to Subdue Mind Warper. And I'll end my turn and check there, but you get your second key! 
I really it's thought I was going to say gunk, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nor, nor, normally you would. Normally you would. Now you're playing this well. Damn. I'm just yeah, but, I'm lucky that I have the generation. Right. But, uh, unfortunately, I literally don't have anything in my hand or on the field that, 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 that will keep you from, uh, from from forging that last key. Whew, that's what I was hoping. If I'm reading, if I'm reading that correctly. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I guess I am reading that correctly. So, uh, I'm just, I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna go out with a bang. Do it. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Hell yeah. Good game, dude. That was close. Yeah, man, that was that, that was really that, that was that was really close. Actually, yeah, man, you were like oh, wow. you saw your paths that the deck wanted to take, and I mean you made them happen. That's a cool deck. If you can get those it's pieces what? down, uh, like you can really make that Mars sing. Oh, agreed. Yeah. Well done. It's one of the it's one of the very few uh, one of the very few decks that I actually um, like do know a good amount about. Mm -hmm. That's a fun. Oh, one. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to press me, can you? Oh, you're good. You want to play another one? Uh, um, yeah, sure, why not? If no, if no one else is wanting want to join in. Yeah, we've got time. Alright, I'll leave Let's the game. Set up a new room so you can grab another deck. Fuck it, Doki. Jordan smells. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, gonna deafen real quick, we are right back. You're good. You're watching the Keyforge Coffee Break, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. We got a lot of uh, a lot of people here. Lively chat. We do this every weekday, noon to 1 p.m. Central. Play some Keyforge on my lunch break. Get to chat with you lovely people. So thank you for being here. This is our deck of the day, Sir Caprazzle Foreman, squeaking out two wins today. One of these days I'll queue in, but got to keep grinding work for now. Yeah, I, I feel you. I feel you. But yeah, you are always welcome to... Uh, Jump in the queue, Orion. I just appreciate you being here at all. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, all week we've been looking at some old Mass Mutation decks and uh, <laughs> actually having a little bit more success with this one, but it's just a weird deck. It's got the Ember generation, though, and that's, I mean, that's that's the game, right? You just need to make that Ember. All right, let's get into it. Let's do it. Bringing the horsemen. Yep. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Hell yeah. So, okay. There's so much good going on in this deck. I I love playing against it. Okay. I'm just trying I've to I've just got to actually... No. I, I, I've just got to actually play it right. <laughs> and Yep. You're just playing it. We'll get it. Let's see. Because the last uh, the last time I played with it uh, on uh, on the stream, I did not play it right at all. It's definitely. Um, I mean, draw order is a big deal, and then mm -hmm. just wrapping your head around the horseman combos and when to play them is interesting. Because a lot of right. people now just they know how to play against the horseman. But those two rings of invisibility is amazing, and always as uh, just having too much to protect is such a good card. Right. Like, just even to have on the list, even if you don't get to play it, it changes the game dramatically. So, okay. cool. Good luck, my dude. You too, my dude. I'm going first this turn, so I will keep this hand. I should keep this hand. Yeah, sure, I'll keep, I'll, I'll keep that in. So I'm gonna do this little cheeky move, Imperial Trader. Damn. <laughs> I was hoping to catch one of your horsemen. Because I get to look <laughs> at your hand and then purge a Sanctum card. So at least I know what we're working with. Yeah, I, I feel that keep. That's a solid keep. And I will purge that Staunch Knight and throw it back to you. I don't like that you got rid of Staunch Knight, though. I'll Better than losing it. Horseman of Death. Turn one. I mean, you're, I mean, you're not wrong. Um. Okay. We will play Shadows this turn. 
<sighs> I'll put I'll put, put, put out my skeleton key. Hell yeah. And then uh, put Nexus out of the field. Hell yeah. Uh, and I will uh, end it there. All right. Now I'm putting the ring on Nexus. Don't like it that much. <laughs> Let's throw it down. Subtle auto. Okay, I'll, I'll take that. Cannon kills a lot of my guys in this deck. Aww. We're gonna mud Nexus. I didn't like that. <laughs> I didn't like any of that. <laughs> I really hope I can learn this someday um, so I can play on a coffee break. Mostly to give you a good ass kicking. Oh, okay. Hell yeah, Violet. Yeah. I got it, yeah. We gotta just make yeah. a learning Keyforge video. We'll go, uh, we'll I'll, go Brobnar. I'll loan you some decks. Bring, uh, bring out uh, Hebe the Huge. Ooh! Yeah, Hebe will do it. <laughs> Hebe is like seven cannons built in. <laughs> and then we'll... Uh... And I'll punch me ahead of the mutant, mutant cut purse. Look at all that spot removal. Yes. Damn. We stand. <laughs> we stand some spot removal. And then I'll put down my uh, my gauntlet of command. Such a good and card. There. So good that I don't think they reprinted it. Is gauntlet really? of command in Age of Ascension? Let me look that up. It has to be, right? I would think, but I'm I just not, don't I'm remember. Not okay, it is. It is an Age of Ascension. Gotcha. What am I thinking? That card is really good, though. Oh, video's up from yesterday. Everybody, go check out Lavinus Twitch on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Violet, when I visit, I'm definitely buying a deck from over there. Because I'll always remember where I got it. Let's do Untamed. Let's throw down Cephalois. Oh, I understand. Stampede a little better. So we'll put that on Cephalois. There we go. I am in check, my boy. Don't like that. Um. Okay. Well, I don't like you being in check. <laughs> I'll be I'll be completely honest with you there. That's fair. I'll go I'll go shadows. It's a great board game shop in Wales we have to go to. The owner wants to sleep with my friend, so he gives her and me well, discounts. Off, oh my god. Hey right. bad penny. There's so much to unpack there, but I would love to go. <laughs> Give, uh, I'll give Hebe my uh, my ring of invisibility. That's terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like an invisible Hebe the huge. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, and then I'll play. Uh... Oh, nice. Oh, wait. Ha <laughs> ha! You can't steal from me because of Cephaloist. Oh, oh, I just read that. I Shit. forgot that too. <laughs> oh, well, you still got an ember from it. Yeah, that's true. Uh, but I'll go. But I'll go ahead and uh, go ahead and use a uh, skeleton key. Yes, yes. Yeah. So, I, <laughs> so at least, uh, so at least you only have enough enough to forge. <laughs> That's uh, that's I something. Agree. I agree. It's amazing. And then I'll go it's like ahead. Like a grand betrayal. And re with Nexus. Very nice. And I'll emit right that. Very nice. Uh, Wait. I don't have a lot going on this turn. I can at least go Star Alliance and bounce that penny and kill Nexus. I'm gonna okay. subdue Hebe the Huge. He's almost dead. Throw down Garcia and give her some blast shielding. 
Oh, of course you bring out Garcia. <laughs> we stand Garcia. <laughs> And I also have a Vault's Blessing in here with, like, maybe... Who are my mutants? Mutant Cut Purse. Xeno Thief. Uh, Cephalo is Cephalo. Four mutants? Is Gloriana's Tendon a mutant? I think so. No, I don't even think that is. So maybe, like... I think I have four mutants in here. Oh, it is a mutant. So five mutants. Yeah, this deck is right, just we'll kind of weird. Uh, we'll play Shadows. We'll bring Bad Benny back. Hello, Bad Benny. <laughs> oh wait! Oh, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to go. I didn't mean to go Shadows. Oh, we can change that. Yes, please. Yeah, just pull <laughs> Bad Penny back in your hand, and then click one of your other houses. Just click. Just click one. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm clicking it. So I think. Is it not working? Oh, I'm, yeah. Uh, no, it's not working. Okay. Um, here we'll just do this. You just end your turn, and I'll end my turn. That works. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, you're good. There you go. Alright, thank you. So instead oh, of that... Oh, active house prompt. Okay. We'll do that next time. Thank you, Orion. So instead of that, we will go... Uh, we'll go Sanctum. And play Blinding Light. Ooh. And Sun Garcia. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> and then alright um, rem remind, remind me of elusive and skirmish really quick so skirmish when you use a creature that has skirmish to attack it does not take damage if you attack a creature with elusive no damage is dealt but if you attack gotcha. with a creature that has elusive nothing happens Okay, so so Hebe would be kind of in, in, invincible then, or yes, if Hebe, well, but Hebe is paralyzed. But if Hebe was used to fight right now, it has skirmish, it would not take damage. And then if Hebe is right. attacked, the first time he's attacked, he does not take damage or deal damage. Right. Okay. So if I were to play a card that would that would automatically ready him, like ready and re 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 ready him and fight. Would that get rid of the uh, the stun? Or? It will get rid of the stun and exhaust him. Yes. But, and well, what, what, would I still be able to use the use the card's effect then? Yes. Or that just get okay. Yeah. So like if you, oh yeah, there you go. So it'll ready remove the stun there. All right. So then, uh, so I'm good to. Uh, Attack Willy Nilly. That's amazing, actually, because it got rid of the stun and you got to kill two people. That's sick. <laughs> That's nasty. <laughs> no, I like to that. I love it. Good job, dude. That was a really good move. Thank Shit. <laughs> oh, and I can't. Oh, I can't stop you. All right. So we'll go shadows this turn. Throw down Nexus. And fidget. And fidget has a damage icon to finish off that Hebe. But you there. get your key. Yay, I got it. That was a cool move, man. Oh. That was good. That was good. Um Okay, we'll go uh, we'll go shadows. Yeah. We'll go shadows. Shadow phase. And then we will play Poison Wave. Oof! Why didn't it, why, why didn't that do any, any damage to uh Garcia has two armor because of blast shielding. Oh, gotcha. But still good. And then we'll play Bad Penny out there. Just to not get her out of my damn hand. hand. <laughs> and uh just because just because 
I think it's fun. <laughs> yeah. Might as well. Right. And with that, we'll end. When the horsemen come out, I'm in trouble. All right, we're going to go untamed. We'll throw down Gloriana's attendant. We'll play Wild Bounty, which has a damage icon. And then I can get three Ember from Vault Blessing here. Oh, my bad. Check. Check a Rooney. Gloriana's attendant. Oh, basically, oh. just a one power creature, but it threw Ember icons into my deck. Okay, interesting. Um. Okay. We will play. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll go Shadows. I'll play Nerve Blast. Ooh. Get rid of Nexus. Ooh. Or should I take on Glori Gloriana's attendant? Uh, what, are the, wait, wait, what does the Enhanced Ember do again? So all that means is that when the deck was being built, it since Gloriana's attendant is in my deck, two extra Ember icons showed up somewhere else. So Gloriana's attendant oh. is just a base one power creature. Gotcha. So it doesn't do anything. So you, you pick the right target. Okay. Good. Mm -hmm. Good to hear. Um, all right, we'll bring out uh, Carla Phantom. Ooh, it's my favorite Nickelodeon show. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Carla's cool. Uh, and then we'll also uh, upgrade aid, uh, Carlo with Dusk Runner. Nice. We'll also play, also play Bad Penny. <laughs> and pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Then we'll uh, then we'll play. Uh, we we'll use we we'll use Skeleton Key and have a uh, have Carlo Phantom capture it. And each time I play an artifact, he steals, doesn't he? Each time you each play, time you play one, one, not use. Oh well, I don't have I don't have any artifacts anyway. That's lucky. So at least you only have enough to, to forge. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, that's all I got right now. It's not bad. All right. We'll go into Star Alliance, remove the stun on Garcia. Keep the blast shield in there. We're going to put Crewman Yorg over here. Capture one. This Crewman Yorg over here. We'll put an Observe you Max on Garcia. So when she fights or reaps, she captures one and raises your key cost. Feeling like that. Uh, okay. We will go Brognar this time. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't like it. We'll play War Drummer. Then I'm gonna punch Garcia. Ooh. And then then I'll bring out my troll. Oh, hi troll. Oh, hi Mark. <laughs> and uh, then we will. Uh, Play Gauntlet of Command. Mm -hmm. To use Carlo Phantom, since he has an elusive skirmish, he cannot be damaged. Uh, we'll do. Uh, I mean, it'd be nice to take out a, take a Glory a Gloria as a 10, but you don't have enough untamed to actually do a whole lot of stuff at the, at the moment. So. Yeah, we'll do. Oh, wait, I. Oh, wait. Oh. Did you want to armor? I fought Garcia, but I, could, but I forgot that she has blast shielding. Oh, right. Would you rather fight someone else or with someone else? 
Mm, yes, but I yeah, but that, but that's, that, that's my fault for not reading it. We'll no, it. no, 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 no. You're you're learning. This is how you learn. <laughs> All right. Let's play. It. Yeah, I want you to do the most optimal plays when you can. Okay, I appreciate it. Yeah, of course. All right. So how we do that? Uh, just tell me what you want to do, and we'll figure it out. Uh, we'll have a uh, uh play playing Gahan of Command again. On Carla Phantom, and I'll do one damage to the other. Oh, oh we'll, 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 we'll do damage uh, uh, to the uh, uh, to uh, Yord. Okay. So, Let's turn that on, and we will add a damage there. There we go. Okay, and now I'm good. Okay. Appreciate it, man. Of course. The Star Alliance, we're gonna steal. We're gonna play Secure Droid next to Garcia, because Secure Droid has Taunt. And we will leap with Garcia, keep the Blast Shielding on Garcia. She will capture and raise a key cost for one turn. Okay, so... <laughs> I love this concept. <laughs> I'm having the time of my life, dude. Okay, so for now, hopefully I'll, I will last another turn for, 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 for my next uh, um, idea. But for now, we'll go Shadows. We'll put that ring of invisibility on the troll. Then we'll uh, use my skeleton key to have Carlos steal another ember. I really don't like an invisible troll. <laughs> Gonna have to dip, but thanks for a fun hour. Hopefully see you tonight. Uh, oh, don't ever apologize, Violet. Bad penny. Truly. Oh, I'm sorry you're annoyed at yourself. But yeah. And uh, we'll have Carlo do do do, do another damage to Yorg. Hope to see you tonight, Violet. I hope you have a good one. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out. Alrighty. I don't like... I don't like Invisible Troll. Well, better steal with Yorg while I got the chance, right? <laughs> sure. Why not? I'm gonna stun Troll. Don't like that. And I'm in check. Briefly. Briefly. We'll see how long it lasts. Okay. Do have skeleton key. We'll go Pick Rock Nar. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. We'll play uh, play Ganger Chieftain. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Wait. So real quick, yeah. Let's uh, pull Ganger Chieftain back into your hand. Okay. So before you play him, let's pretend that you used Troll to exhaust the stun. Okay. Now play Ginger Chieftain back down. Okay. That's fair. That way you can fight with him immediately. And then you'll be able to fight with Gauntlet. Correct. So we'll get rid of second droid. Nice. Oh, Ring of Invisibility on Troll. That's beautiful. And we'll use a Gauntlet Command on Carlo Phantom to take out Yorg. Then we will oh, bring out Bumpsy. Bumpsy! Beautiful. And then we'll reap with War Drummer. 
And that's my turn. All right, we'll go shadows. We're gonna make it a little tough on you. Two bone niffings are gonna steal from you, and then my sneaky snake comes out. Yeah. Yeah. You, uh, you won. Whoo! Damn. I was, I was reading really quick. I'm like, oh crap, I, I don't, I don't have any, uh, I don't have any artifacts to play for, for Carla Van, Van Steel. Um, you could keep me off the key for one more turn. How's that? If you reap with Carlo, because he has Dusk Runner, you'll steal one. And then if you capture oh. with skeleton key, I'll be down to five. Oh, so that's at least that's something. That's true. Yeah, that's true. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I didn't read that. I didn't read that right. All right, so we'll go. Is that, if I read with Carlo? Yep. That's right. That's right. Yep. We'll do skeleton key. Uh, to cap to, to capture one. That's true. Didn't read that. Then we'll, then we'll play. Ooh, silver, play silver tube. tube. Hello. Hello. And we'll go ahead and reap with silver tubes. Silver tube's so cool. They need to make more creatures that just come in ready. It's a neat idea. Right. <laughs> or maybe they don't. <laughs> maybe there's a reason they haven't since Coda. And uh, and since there's uh, like since you're like you're gonna, you're gonna be a check here soon, and there's no way that you can have uh, exactly one ember. We'll play ghost hand. We'll, oh we'll yeah, ghost absolutely hand. play ghostly hand for that ember. And it looks oh, and then I'll reap. Actually, we'll fight with that then, just to get rid of that. Sure. Get rid of that. For sure, 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 sure. I'll bring it right back out. And I'll end it with that. All right. So now, I'm hoping to assure my victory. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> Yeah, with a love with a love ember, I would uh, I would I would hope so. <laughs> Holy hell! I know that TMTP is in the discard pile. Wait, how did you get rid of Carlo? I uh, had a damage icon on Shadow Smith, so I threw that over there. Um, gotcha. That sucks. <laughs> that really sucks. Um. Hmm. Okay. Let me read here. There's got to be something to do, right? You think? No, no. There's not really any. There's not really much I can do. Yeah. No. There's, there's nothing I can do. This is all I all I could do uh, would be to Ooh. play low Lo mirror there. You've got a surprising amount of ember control in there. Yeah, it's it, it, it's it's interesting. And um, yeah, that's that that's that, that's really all all I all I can do. And then just to reap with a with, with a with a with a with a bunch of people. Oh, I didn't mean to attack, but eh, oh, that's bad, Penny. <laughs> oh well. Uh yeah, and then and then, and then just reap. 
all I really have. There we go. You win. Three to two, though. Another good game, my dude. That was good. That yeah. was good. Thanks for playing, man. I'm like that, man. I love it. I love when you when you jump on the coffee break. Me too. Me too. Good games. Good games. Well, I just re I just I just realized, but both uh both games that we that we we've, that we played, I've uh I've I've ended with two with two keys and four ember. Yeah. I'm so close every time. I know you did great. <laughs> Good job, my guy. Thank you, man. You too. All right. Well, thanks for playing. I'm going to sign off of here. Sounds good. See you later tonight, hopefully. Oh, there's no, 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 no doubt. Cool. All right. Oh, see yeah. you, buddy. Bye. Oh, man. Hey, what's up, Wolfstar? Good to see you again. Welcome back. Welcome back. Sorry, you're catching me right at the end of this one. And I'm back after showering. What's up, Bing? Bing's back, too. <laughs> all right y'all hey happy friday everybody that was a lot of fun i'm really glad glad that jordan got to join me on the keyforge coffee break for today and that's gonna do it for me uh we play keyforge every weekday here on the channel noon to 1 p.m central uh next week we'll be back on monday to play some more keyforge same time same channel uh <laughs> might bring back the ska channel that was so fun Today was a good one, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. Seriously. Very, very fun. Uh, tonight is the drunk stream. Starting at 6 p.m. Central, we're going to continue Crash Bandicoot 4. Hopefully beat it. Hopefully. I'm not making any promises, though. I've been making promises that I was going to beat that game since November. And it's January. So we'll see how it goes. But until I see you all next time, please have a good rest of your day. Good rest of your night, wherever, whenever you are. Um, thanks so much for tuning in. Be safe. Be good to yourselves. Be good to one another. Keep forging. I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.